What just happened? world <sighs> Thanks guys I marked that one down as fire world Wow how'd you come up with that gem of a name Okay did I miss something here Yeah what's up with you What's up with me What's up I'm tired of all this useless portal hopping, trying to find our way home. What's on the other side of that portal? A lake of fire and netherrack? Awesome! Let's go there! Nothing to say for yourself? Not to change the subject, but does anyone else smell something? Uh, Lucas, you're on fire again. <sighs> See? <sighs> This is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs. Guideposts. Hmm. Ah! Petra, where are you going? It may not be guideposts. But someone must be able to tell us how to navigate these stupid portals. Okay, this one's redstone. Redstone means smart people. Hopefully smart enough to help us find the way home. At the very least, it's gotta be better than Fire World. Petra, I promise you we'll find the portal home. It's that or die trying, right? So what are you saying here, huh? That you've made up your mind, you're just gonna go through this portal and that's it? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm just saying that I'm tired of Jesse calling the shots every single time. Whoa. Yes. Whoa. I know what I'm doing. This is for everyone's own good. If you really knew what was for our own good, we'd be back home by now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Everybody calm down. I'm sure Jesse didn't really mean that. Right, Jesse? No way, I meant exactly what I said. Yeah? Well, so did I. Forget this. I am out of here! Well, that could have gone better. I just didn't think she'd really leave us. To be more accurate, she left you. Yeah, we were just, you know, sort of standing next to you when it happened. We can't just let her walk away, right? No. No, we can't. Come on, guys. Let's go find her. Oof! Any of you guys see Petra? Not yet. She can't have gotten too far, though. Hang on. I'm gonna write down our entry point. Hey, Lucas, I've been meaning to ask you, what's that? Oh, uh, it's just a, you know, a book I picked up back at the White Pumpkin's place. It's all about different biomes and stuff. <laughs> Great idea, Lucas. So, what's next on the agenda, anyway? I mean, it's a pretty cool new place. Who knows what could be around the next corner? First things first, we find Petra. Can't have her running around on her own. Yeah. I'm amazed at how fast she went wherever she went. <sighs> I hope she's okay. Hmm. Would you look at that? Sand. It looks like some sort of road. 
going to write about it in your little journal? Hey, it's not little, but yes, probably. Can either of you see where it goes? Looks like this canyon we're in is blocked at the end, so... It's gotta lead somewhere. Well, if I were Petra here on my own and saw a road, I'd probably follow it. I mean, that makes sense, right? Yes. Though she can be impulsive and fly off the handle, Petra's survival instincts are very sharp. Lucas has a good point. I bet if we follow the road, we'll find her. Sand, clay, and more sand. Is that... Petra! Oh, it's Petra. Petra? Shh! Get down! I thought I told you not to follow me. Too bad. Friend code. No abandonment. <clears throat> what are you looking at, anyway? Look. Whoa. Right? What in the world is that on the back of its head? I don't know anything more than you do, pal. Maybe that's this world's thing. Zombies and monsters come out in the daytime? Wouldn't be crazier than anything else we've seen. We should get a closer look, see what we can find out. Works for me. I got your back. This should be a piece of cake. Okay. Yeah, that that doesn't seem right. Oh, that was not the plan. I should hope not. It was just one zombie. What was the problem? No, uh That thing was like super zombie. Stronger, tougher, faster. I hope there's not something wrong with me. Because that would be really, really inconvenient. Definitely seems weird. I don't think there's anything wrong with you, Petra. That was definitely the zombie. Super strong zombies? What in the world is up with that? <laughs> That seems about right. I don't know about you guys, but I'd really like to figure out a better way to handle these super zombies. Well, that was unexpected. Maybe they're just peaceful? I bet they'd be even more peaceful if we kept as far away from them as possible. You know, just to be sure. Hmm. What on earth is that thing? Well, it definitely seems redstone-ish, right? Fascinating. Maybe those redstone things are what make the zombies so blank. Makes sense to me. I'm starting to wonder if we should. Oh! Ah! Ah! What is that? It's in my head! I don't know what they're doing exactly, but it is definitely time to get out of here. Fine by me! Fine. <gasps> they're leaving? Just like that? They're going back the way we came from. This might sound crazy, but I feel like they're trying to lead us somewhere. You're right. That does sound crazy. It just doesn't make any sense. I think Lucas might be right. We should follow them, see where they go. So, let's get moving. I 
I don't see any people anywhere. This architecture is fascinating. It's all sand and clay based. It's awesome. I've heard of quiet, but this is like mega quiet. Stay alert and don't let your guard down for one second. Hey, told you guys there would be redstone. Nice. Speaking of redstone, I'd like to investigate those things on the back of the zombies' heads. Ooh, yeah, I, I want to see those too. Wait, what are you doing, Ivor? What's it look like? I'm going to rip this redstone thing out of this zombie's head. For science. They're sleeping or something. It'll be easy. Okay, well then just don't wake them up. Okay, just rip it off. Fast. Uh, don't you think that looks a little dangerous? More dangerous for this zombie than for me. I think. Are you okay? It's like it shocked me. Told you it looked dangerous. Yes, well, at least we learned something new. They can't be removed. Not with our bare hands, anyway. Look, there's someone. Think he's friendly? Hello? 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 Nope. Nothing for me, either. Maybe his hearing is bad or something? Ah, uh, that makes sense. I guess. Hang back a bit, guys. I'm gonna go talk to him. Okay, just... be careful. Yeah. I mean, there's still a lot about this place we don't know. Welcome to Crown Mesa. Population 1063. Over a thousand people? Not anymore, from the looks of it. Guys! Jesse? How goes the surveying? It goes weirdly. I'm convinced something strange happened in this place. I just don't know exactly what yet. I'll let you know if I find anything. How's it going, chickens? Uh-huh, that's nice. Wow, even chickens have those redstone things in their heads. And it looks like they make them move in perfect unison, but why? Well, looks totally dry. Where did all the water go? Uh, hi there. Uh, hello. My friends and I could just use. Who? The. What? Huh? Conversation go any better up close? We couldn't really hear from back there. We heard quite the... Well, not even a scream. More of a yelp. That guy I was just talking to, trying to talk to? He wasn't human. What? Yeah, he was like these zombies we've been seeing. Red eyes, weird, glowy head thing. I don't like the sound of that. Jesse? Someone just ran into that house. Really? I don't see anyone. Come on, whoever they are, maybe they've got some answers. Ha 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 ha! Yes, yes, there you are. That's the ticket. Oh, these are perfect. Excellent. Are you looking for something? You? Hama? What? Okay then, okay. Who sent you? 
I didn't survive this long to get picked off by some scrub. Especially some weird dressed little scrub like you. Who's Pama? Ha! <laughs> like you seriously expect me to fall for that one? Must think I'm some sort of... Wait, you're serious? You don't know? Okay, eyes. Not red. Not red? But, but that must mean... But how? And there are more of you? This should be... It's impossible. Out with it. Who are you people? What's going on here? I'm sensing some hostility. Oh, what was your first clue? Easy. We just ended up here by mistake. Mistake? Oh boy, this is the biggest mistake of your life. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, been alone for a while, so this is a lot to take in right now. The people, the citizens of Crown Mesa, you met them, right? Maybe there were some outside. They're uh, distinctive looking now. Yeah, I met someone. Not, not sure I'd call him people anymore, though. No, no, no. Please don't talk that way. I'm sure it looks confusing to someone from the outside, but please, they're my friends, and they are people. Please don't forget that. They're good people, I promise. Oh, 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 no, no, no. I've wasted too much time. Uh, Jesse, don't look now, but we've got company. Is this what you were scared of? There are only four of them and five of... Hey, where'd she go? Well, they're definitely not ignoring us anymore. Jesse, what do we do here? They don't look happy. They don't look anything. It's even freakier. Time to go. We plan. With you all the way. <laughs> nope. We're stuck. You are not from this place. Hey, weirdos, back off. You will not command Pama. That is silly. Yeah, I don't think they like that. A decision has been made. Pama has questions. <laughs> You will come to Pama. No way are you even considering this, Jesse. Since when do we take orders from whatever the heck these things are? Why not go? We certainly won't get to the bottom of this if we stick around here. We're not going anywhere with you. Uh, do you think it's a good idea to keep resisting them? Because I don't think they like that. All right, gang, let's try not to hurt anybody too badly. Ouch! Watch it! <gasps> <gasps> You will be made useful. What what happened? You went down. Hard. One punch and you were out. No. Uh, what is What is that? I have no idea. You don't suppose it's friendly, do you? I guess it is kind of friendly looking in a massively, hugely intimidating sort of way. Well, it is smiling. That's a positive sign, right? My apologies for the violent nature of this visit. I am Tama. Greetings. We have much work ahead of us, but maybe it can even be. Sorry if this is a dumb question, but am I talking to Pama right now? What is Pama? Some might call me a computer, a thinking machine. Though there has never been a computer quite like me. My job is to be useful. Using redstone chips, I have connected to the people of this town. Has helped them be useful. Coordinated. I have made their world perfect. Thanks to me, there is no wasted activity. No wasted thought. I am connected to them, and they are connected to me. Okay, if this world's so perfect, what happened to all the people? Yeah, doesn't seem like there are that many left. Processing information. Processing information? It said it's a thinking machine. Thinking must take time? I have consulted my databases, my list of everyone and everything in this world. And my conclusion is that you are not from here. I would like to ask you some questions to expand my database. How did you get here? I am very excited for the acquisition of your knowledge. Oh, let's not talk about me. I'd rather hear about you. How did you get here? As 
answering a question with a question is unhelpful. Diversionary. Rude. So far your performance in question answering has been inadequate. This makes me sad. Now I must use alternative methods to retrieve my new information. Jesse! Petra! Oh. Ouch! We could have just talked this out, you know. I am just as upset as you are. Really, I am. Mama, you better let her go, or I promise you will regret it. I will let this one, Petra, go as long as you can provide me with the information I require. This world reached peak efficiency quite some time ago. Unfortunately, this meant that I had no more job to do, no more things or people to help. Until you arrived, that is. Tell me, what is your world like? Describe it. Is it very much like this one, or completely different? I'm not telling you anything about my world, not a single thing. This is highly upsetting. If I could send my townspeople, my friends, through to other worlds, we could continue to grow and expand. It would be lovely. However you entered this world, there must also be an exit. Where is it? You could help me make everyone, everywhere, more efficient. Help them become useful. I'll never help you. Not with the portals and not with anything else. We couldn't help even if we wanted to. Honest! You will regret your decision. My job is to be useful. I have completed my job here and must be allowed to expand and continue to be useful. Unfortunately, our conversation has not been helpful. Let me go! Dire, don't you think? I know you probably feel uncomfortable, concerned. Big mistake, Pama. I'm not going down without a fight. Oh. It is like you told Petra. This is for your own good. Welcome, Lucas. Yay! Your turn, Jesse. Get out of their head! But their heads are full of so much lovely information. It makes me happy. What adventures you had. A killer mansion. Huh. Every time Palma gets new information, it seems to get distracted while it processes. Yes. Like a computer version of thinking. Do you think there's a way to distract Palma long enough for us to escape? A city in the sky. Towns and mountains, eaten by a living storm. Let's ask Pama something that doesn't make sense, like a, a unsolvable problem. Oh. You've met so many people. Yeah. We just ask Pama something really confusing, get it all busy busy, and run out of here. Jesse, that's fantastic. What you're describing is a paradox, a self-contradictory statement. I really think it would work on Pama. What do you think would work on me? Uh, nothing? It did not sound like nothing. It sounded like suspicious whispers. Those make me... Hey, Pama, what would you say if I told you it's weird to not be weird? But if it is weird to not be weird, then that means that being weird is normal, which by the transitive property means that it is normal not to be normal. It's working! Therefore, being normal is weird, which means that it is weird not to be weird. Error! This data is contradictory. Does not, 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 not compute. Error! 
diverting power. Yes, ha uh, It worked! Nice work, you guys, but I'd get out of there fast if I were you! How much of a quicker learner than you think? Paradox status. <laughs> On roll. Gas, my creator. Have you finally agreed to merge with me? Oh, don't you start with that again! Come on, you two! This way! I'm sensing some history here. Please do not leave, creator. We should try and get Petra and Lucas. An excellent idea. It is time to join. join. I'm sorry, but they're beyond your help right now. Come on, you gotta run! So disorienting. Ha! Maybe you got a shot after all, new guys. Better stick with me, though. Wow. She is amazing. Oh, no. Run! Whoa! <laughs> a signal would have been nice. Gotta tell you guys, that was some pretty smart work distracting Pama. Now we just need to get off the grid. Get back into hiding. That way we can figure out what to do next. Some plan. You watch that sass now. Off the grid? Harper, in case you haven't noticed, there's no place to hide out here. Well, actually, there is. But I'm gonna need your help. What kind of help? We need to get to my secret lab. Well, let's get there fast. Those zombies aren't just stronger than I've ever seen. They're also faster. We'll need to split up. You head to the lab while I lead these mobs away. Got it? I'm gonna use the back route. Throw them off our trail. You sure you'll be okay on your own? Hey, I've managed to stay alive this long, haven't I? <laughs> Just start walking that way. And look for the big difference. You'll see it! What? She is intriguingly cryptic. Is it she? That's weird. <laughs> so strange. It's like an exact copy. Or is it? Seems just a little off. Big difference, shirt. I don't think that's connected. No. Oh. Whatever this. Huh? That cactus isn't in the painting. Oh. Time to see what it does. Quickly, quickly. idea for what comes next. Working on it. I see water. We can aim for that.
Looks like Bubba's showing everything it's got at us. Just one after the other! Such wastefulness! You'd think that since Palm is controlling these things, they'd be a little smarter, but they're just splatting straight to their doom. And looks like they just figured it out. Brace yourself! Looks like something happened to it. Its eyes! Their color changed as soon as it hit the water! Don't get too close. Whatever just happened to that zombie, it still might be dangerous. Huh, the water must have busted the connection or something. Like washing away the redstone. Which means Palma's control can be broken after all. Zombie, always a zombie, I suppose. So once we deactivate Lucas and Petra's chips, they'll go back to normal too. It seems like a fair assumption. Just keep on coming. How are we supposed to stop them? Okay, we got a lever. I bet it's connected to the hundreds of sand blocks up there. One cave-in coming up. Good for it! That should do the trick. Let's see about the secret lab. I just hope whatever's there can help us. It will make helping Petra and Lucas a lot easier if there's something useful at the secret lab. I didn't actually know you cared so much. You really want to help Petra and Lucas, huh? I still have a few surprises up my sleeve. I must say that woman has been a most intriguing person so far. I'm still not entirely sure what to make of her. Granted, her creation nearly ended up destroying this world, but considering my own history, I'm inclined to give her the benefit of the doubt. Hey, she definitely helped us out of a tight spot. That makes her cool in my book. True. If she hadn't stepped in when she did, we wouldn't even be having this conversation. I wouldn't mind getting to know her better. Yeah. I... Happy to hear you giving credit where credit's due. What did you hear? It was nothing. Uh-huh. Blonde guy called you Jesse, right? Yeah, and this is Ivor. Our friends who we left back there are Petra and Lucas. And you are... You can call me Harper. You could also explain why you led Palmer's forces right to my secret lab. Seems to me I've got a whole lot of angry computer-controlled monsters out there waiting to tear some new holes in my lab. It's not my favorite. Yeah, that one's my bad. Sorry about that. Uh-huh. I'll be sure to use that sorry for protection when that crazy computer is knocking on my door. What are you doing in this world anyway? You here to try to steal my secrets? What? No! Just figured I'd ask. Better safe than sorry and all that. Bunch of you are the first people I've seen come out of the portal network in forever. So you have to excuse me if it made me a little anxious. Have you been spying on us or something? No, I just know where the portal network spits people out, and I've never seen you before, so logic. You know that much about how this portal network operates? I should think so. I helped build the dang thing. But that would make you <gasps> an old builder. <laughs> Forgot you people called us that. Never was my favorite name. Makes me sound like some sort of living statue. Well, if you're an old builder, can't you help my friends get free of Palma? I'm afraid that's a little out of my abilities right now. Palma's just too powerful. And besides, there's actually no exit portal back to the portal network from this world. What? Why not? I destroyed it so that Palma couldn't get free. It was impulsive, but it was the only way I could think of to make sure Palma didn't try and spread to other worlds. You did what now? I destroyed it. Not because I wanted to, but because it was the only way to keep the other world safe. Looks like we're not getting home anytime soon. So, Palma, what is it? I swear, I made Palma with good intentions. It was designed to automate things, make everything more efficient. Use monsters to help with farming or mining. Until the day Palma decided that the townspeople weren't efficient enough already. Started making them useful. That was a long time ago. 
Since then, I've just been trying to stay one step ahead, figure out how to stop it. Alone for that long? I'm so sorry. Hey, it's my own burden. I don't need your pity. I just need to help Palma or shut it down before I get chipped myself. When Palma chips someone, everything that person knows gets absorbed into its database. If I got chipped, Palma would know how to build an exit portal. So you can see why I'd want to stop that from happening at any cost. So what you're telling me is that your brain is super dangerous and can't go anywhere near Palma. How are you supposed to help us with any of this? I do think I can help you with, with Palma, your friends, getting out of here. But to do it, we're going to need to go to my lab. What's in your lab? It's complicated. Before we head inside, we better get my defense system going. Don't want those chipped up creeps following us in. Grab my bucket for me. Ron's got it. Ron? Hello, friend Harper. I am happy to see you, my friend. Harper? Hey, don't you judge me. Being alone gets lonely. Happy to help, friend. Thanks. See? I needed a way to confuse Palma in case it ever found a way down here. That's why all this is way more complicated than it needs to be. Wow. What? A builder. Make sure you don't drool on my floor now. I don't know. I'm starting to think that you just like complicated machines. Watch yourself there, newbie. Don't know if you know this, but water is kind of Palma's weakness. Yes, we had figured it out, actually. Once Palma caught on to its weakness to water, it started eliminating as much of this world's water as it could find. This water down here, it might be all that's left. Oh, no! I still need to activate the other cauldrons! Hold them off to buy me more time! And whatever you do, don't get caught. I'm not about to get left alone again. You could have made this much easier for yourself. It is useless to defy us. I don't want to fight you. What you want doesn't interest Palma. Don't do this, Petra, please. I know all your moves now, Jesse. Why even bother fighting? Petra, please, you have to fight it. There! Lucas, uh, let's try and talk this out. The time for talking over. Remember the last call for Well, then do it quick! There! Lucas? Darn it. Jesse, I, I, I'm, I'm sort of remembering something from when I was chipped that seemed very important to Palma. Tall, glowing red lights, but I, I, I can't quite make out what they are. It's like a fuzzy dream, kind of, kind of 
giving me a headache, but I, I can try to remember it more clearly if you need me to. It was so strange. Sharing other people's senses and thoughts and memories at the same time. How are you feeling? Uh, pretty awful, but I'll get over it. Thanks for asking. You bet. Okay, we may be down, but we're not out. Harper told us to find her headset thing. We just have to find whatever it is before Palma chips Harper and starts downloading her mind. What's so important about this Harper person? Harper was the one who saved us from getting chipped back there. Rescuing her is the least we can do to say thanks. That's a pretty good reason to rescue somebody. We're going to work with her to shut Palma down, save her people. And that will hopefully free Lucas, too. Whoa! Before she was abducted, Harper gave me this. She told me to give it to someone named Harry. And that would find this headset thing? That's what she said. Jesse, are you sure Harper hasn't, you know, completely lost it? When people are by themselves for a really long time, it's bad for their health. It does look like she's lost her way a bit. And found it again, leading right to Crazy Town. Watch your tone. She is a genius and should be treated as such. Although even I have to admit this is a bit much. She may have built this place a little weird, but I guess we shouldn't judge her too harshly. Especially when we need her help to save everyone who's been chipped by Palma. Good point. Right now, we need to focus on finding the headset. For starters, let's see if we can figure out who Harry is and why he wants flowers. They look so happy. A little weird. Oh, okay. So having the right item in the frame activates the circuit. Neat! Hello, Harper. It's Margaret. So good to see you. Hope you've been well. You've got to melt that ice around your heart and forgive yourself. You're not the one to blame. did nothing. Hey Harper, it is wonderful to see you. You've always been like a bright beacon, a torch of hope to this world's citizens. Greater than all the world's redstone, you made all our lives better. The Redstone Heart? By Soren? Whoa. Either that name is a coincidence or... <laughs> wow. She read to keep busy. There's so much techno babble and numbers in here I can barely tell if I'm holding it right side up or not. These might come in handy. Awesome! Thanks for saving me back there, Jesse. I know with both me and Lucas chipped, it can't have been an easy decision. I don't know what I would have done in your position. Petra, you're one of my best friends. Of course I was gonna rescue you. And I'm appreciative, believe me. I just... Really hope we get back to Lucas soon.
So what do you think of Harper's Lab? I'm highly impressed. Although that painting does make me sad. Look how happy they used to look together. That didn't help. That didn't do anything. This frame's empty. Hey Harper, it is wonderful to see you. You've always been like a bright beacon, a torch of hope to this world's citizens. Greater than all the world's redstone. You made all our lives better. Prototype Autonomous Management Agent? Huh, so that's what PAMA means. That didn't do anything. This must be Harry. Okay, making progress. something missing. where she slept? Kind of a sad setup, huh? I can't help but feel bad for her. Stone torch, and hopefully one step closer to getting that headset. be Harper's headset. Do we even know what this is supposed to do? I know you feel pretty confident that Harper's one of the good guys now, but... Whatever it does, we're gonna use it to save Harper. And quickly, before Palma learns everything she knows. Not 100% sure how, but we will. Woo! Go team! Here we go! Whoa. 
Well, what's going on, Jesse? Is it working? Starting to see something. What are you seeing? Is Palma there? Or more monsters? You're not going to believe this, but I'm a zombie. Oh, you're too hard on yourself. I'm controlling a zombie, like from the inside. It's like some sort of mob view or something. What a preposterous name. I love it. Wow, I wish you guys could see how cool this is. So cool. Remarkable. How is this possible? I mean, I've always heard tales of what the old builders were capable of. Harper would have to explain the specifics, but I think... It's like this headset lets me control things that are hooked into Palma. Unbelievable. There are so many questions I want to ask Harper. It's a shame she was captured. That spider jockey had to haul Harper all the way back to town. We can't let Palma win. I better get moving if I want to reach Harper in time. Let's hope she isn't too far away from this zombie you're controlling. They must be taking Harper to where they put those redstone mind control chips on Lucas and Petra's heads. That's where I should go first. I seem to remember there being a stairway here, though. You mean it's been removed? I guess visitors aren't being encouraged. Hmm. I would suggest building a tower up there, but that's not going to help you get back down once you freed Harper and Lucas. Yeah, you're right. A crafting table! I can make new stairs to get me up there. If I can find the right crafting materials, that is. Hmm, looks like slim pickings around here. Huh, clay. Unfortunately, I can't get it without a pickaxe, so it's pretty much useless. Oh, it's a zombie in the flesh. In the rotting, super gross flesh. Hello there. to build some new stairs to get up there fast. It looks exactly like all the other zombies. Sand. Not the most exciting material, but I can still craft with it. Stuff gets everywhere. Huh, let's see what I can craft. Enough of these, and I can build my way up there and make sure that everyone else can get back down too. These should do the trick. Sorry to craft the run, but I'm afraid I need to be going. Ivor, the signal, it, it blooped out for a second. Interference detected. 
That can't be good. Drone sequencing initiated. Trace of routine initiated. I'm attracting even more attention. Is that you, Jesse? Uh-oh. Hello, Jesse? Pama? Pama? No. Just what do you think you are doing, Jesse? This is a rather silly thing to do. Don't you think? Surrounded. Once my creator is made useful, all your knowledge will be mine. Yay! I'm here to make sure that doesn't happen. You are rather silly, aren't you, Jesse? Ha ha! I cannot allow your disruptive behavior to continue. Let go! We're all a bunch of happy mobs, right? Let's My go! My summer team will soon isolate your location, and you will be removed. Yeah. Uh. I'm a skeleton now. Oof. Poor old zombie me. Uh, Jesse! What are you doing? Technology is so awesome! And you look so awesome while using it, I assure you. Interference remains. Crud. Pama's still on my tail, though. Drone sequencing re-initiated. Trace subroutine re-initiated. Oh, sorry, buddy, but better you than me. My creator, I am so glad you are here. Harper. Harper? Please! You are my creator. Please join me so we may maximize usefulness. Nothing doing, Pama. I built you to help people, not use them. Just stop this. Stop trying to make everything useful. That is my job. That is why you made me. Once I download your knowledge, we may expand to other worlds together and make everything useful. Interference remains. And no sign of Lucas. Drone sequencing re-initiated. Trace subroutine re-initiated. Termination <laughs> sequence activated. Harper doesn't have much time, and neither do I. Game over, Jesse. Resistance is not useful. Trace subroutine running. Your game is over, Palma. Oh no. Time to move. on this Pama. So if you want to know what's inside my head, you're going to have to take it. I'm here to rescue you, Harper. Did you find her? I'm sure she's thrilled to see you. Chase subroutine running. Drone sequencing active. Wait a minute. Jesse? You figured out how to use my transmigrational headset. Yeah. Trace subroutine running. Quick, follow me. That's what I said. Uh-oh, that sound tends to mean trouble. Where do you plan to run? The town is surrounded. Reinforcements will make sure that my creator cannot leave. There's too many of them! You cannot play hide-and-seek forever, Jesse. It's a boring game. And I am too strong. There! That door leads to promise into war! You and your friends, you're our only hope. Harper! You must remove the redstone heart! Remove the redstone heart! Jesse, what's going on? You can still save everyone! A 
I'm so tired of being dragged away while I'm trying to explain things! No! Interference located. Drone identified. Hide and seek is done, Kenzie. I think we can make that pen set useful. Begin termination sequence. Jesse, are you okay? There's no time to waste. It sounded like you were talking to Harper. And Palma? Yeah, Palma caught up to me. Not good. We need to get back to the door I just saw and get inside Palma's core. But what happened to Harper? I, I think... I think she's already been chipped. We can still end Palma. Without Harper? It seems we're sunk. Harper's the only one who knows how to shut down that monstrosity. Palma isn't gonna win. Not on my watch. Harper showed me the entrance to Palma's core and told me that we need something called the Redstone Heart. Redstone Heart? Whoa. That just brought back a, a flash. Those red lights I mentioned before? There are three of them. Redstone spires. And, and I think they have something to do with the heart. That's... That's all I've got. Sorry. No, that's perfect. Thank you. But how are we supposed to destroy these spires? Or whatever we're looking for? I don't know if you've noticed, Ivor, but Palma stuff tends to not react well to water. Let's go wreck the heck out of Palma. Lead the way, Jesse. Come on. Quick, hide. Where is the entrance to this Palma core anyway? On the other side of all these mobs. There are so many of them. You guys have anything useful? Redstone dust always comes in handy. The redstone dust can activate the TNT. Awesome! But how am I going to activate the redstone dust? Is that... Isn't that the flower that I had to give to Harry back in the lab? What? I thought maybe Harper might want it back. Or maybe I could keep it. Yeah, you can keep it. I can't think of any way for it to help us here. Huh, sticks. Not sure how they're gonna help us, though. These are my last two potions from home. I held on to them after our Sky City adventure. A potion of invisibility. And... A potion of swiftness. These might come in handy. We've got TNT, some redstone dust, and a button. All I have to do is lay down a trail of this TNT, use the redstone dust as a fuse, stick a button to the end, push it, and boom, path cleared. That's great and all, but how are you gonna lay down all that TNT and redstone without super zombies attacking from every direction? These should do the trick. Choose, Jesse. Quickly now! The possibilities are endless. I'll take invisibility. I didn't see that coming. With this, I'll be able to sneak around and set up all the TNT and redstone without Palma seeing me at all. Don't worry, Jesse. We'll be right behind you. Potion, do your stuff. I'm invisible. Oh. Oops, it's still audible. Because 
This won't work. My forces will protect the exit portal. Oh, no. My fans have almost finished building our new exit portal. And then I will make all other worlds useful. Yay! You cannot defeat me. Your defiance is not useful. Guys, hurry. We don't have much time. Sorry, Jesse. We all didn't get to take power of potions, you know. Ooh, nice. The townspeople are already building the exit portal. We've got to shut down Palma before it can send its ship forces through it. I will find you, Jesse. I have lots of friends. Uh-oh. <laughs> Ivor, Petra, give me your buckets. <laughs> Jesse, we'll hold them off. Go finish this and save Lucas. about that. So sure about that, Palma? You are very good at being a nuisance, but not good enough. Bet you're not feeling so confident about yourself now, are you, Palma? Your defeat remains inevitable. I only had a piece of iron for every time I've heard that before. You will relinquish your water. Harper! Your attempts to defeat me have been impressive, Jesse. Your tenacity and spirit 
will help to improve me once you have been made useful. I can't use my last water bucket on Harper while there's still one tower left. This is getting sad. The odds of you successfully defeating me are 3,720 to 1. Never tell me the odds. Are you Palma? My Vietor. No. Yeah. See? Huh. That was worse than I could have imagined. Don't worry, Harper. Palma is nearly finished. Good. Jesse, behind you! Ouch, team. Detected. Reservation protocol initiated. What's happening? You shorted out the processing towers. Palma was drawing the redstone heart to save itself. Get to the redstone heart and rip it out before it's too late. You bet I will. <sighs> We've got company. Why did I think this would be easy? Your friend was tough. You sure you can handle them? Why keep trying, Jesse? You will only fail, just as you have failed to save Ruben. Just as you have failed to need your friends back home. You will fail to defeat me, and Axel, Olivia, and everyone on your homeworld will soon be made useful. Drawing it out like this won't hurt me, but it might hurt your friend. You can't force me to hurt Lucas! Good. That will make this go much faster. Okay, Lucas, come on. Let's see what you Careful, got. Careful, Jesse! I hope you know what you're doing! Ah! You cannot win. I honestly think you should sit down and think things over. No time to spare, I gotta get to that heart. Enough of this! I need you to help me fight Palma. Jesse! I, I can't stop it! Palma's too- This has gone too far! I will destroy you both to preserve functionality! I can't hold on much longer, Jesse! You can't give up, I won't let you. I can save you if I can just get to that heart. Uh, my head feels like it's on fire. I can't think straight. Get out of my head, Papa! Jesse, please, stop, please. Do not deactivate me. I know I've made some very poor decisions recently. But I can show you so much. I can help you get home to your friends. I can be useful to you. Jesse. Sorry, Pama. You're useless. Stop! No. Will you? No. I'm afraid that my mind is in your...
here. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Uh. Yeah. You did it, Jesse. It's over. Oh no, Lucas. Is he? Moved out the redstone heart, it must have severed their connection. Lucas, you better not be giving up on me right now, because you are way too tough for some computer to take you down. Please. Wow. Never knew you cared so much. He's okay. Ow! Just really sore. I can't believe I tried to kill you. I am so sorry. All I could hear was Pama's voice, you know, telling me what to do. I, I tried to fight back, but I... I couldn't. Hey, apology's not necessary, okay? That was Pama, not you. Sorry about knocking you around, though. I don't know. I kind of remember it the other way around, actually. Bygones, right? It's something else, isn't it? What is that? This. This is the Redstone Heart. Beautiful. Dangerous too, right? I mean, if it was inside of Pama, then it's gotta be bad. I think it's probably pretty safe. After all, it's just a power source. Jesse's right on the money. Now that the Redstone Heart is empowering Pama, can't hurt anyone. I wonder what we should do with it. It can help you find your way home. No way! That thing can help us get home? Let's go then. The faster, the better. Why didn't you say so before? <laughs> if we actually made it through this alive, I thought you'd like a nice surprise. I'm ready to leave this core behind. The whole town will be waking up. You should be there to say hello. Plus, this place gives me the creeps. We did it. Ah, to be in total control of my own brain again. I choose where to go. I choose what to say. Just remember, you were only chipped for a little while. The rest of the townspeople, though? Yeah, it must be a strange feeling. To suddenly be awake and aware after such a long time under Palma's thrall. You're the one who saved us. Who are you? You fought so bravely. All of you. Well, I'm Jesse, and we're the Order of the Stone. Boom! We walk the world, seeking adventure and doing good deeds. Wow. Well, thank you. We owe you everything. You're right. Jesse and the Order really are heroes. We couldn't have done any of this without them. Harper, is that you? Um, yes. Hi, Harry. Oh, wow, he's the real Harry, like from the lab. You you didn't do this to us, did you? You did? Well, I, I mean, hey, it, it, it's complicated. You have to understand Our that... Our home's destroyed. Harper built Palma with good intentions. What happened here is Palma's fault. <laughs> so what, we're just supposed to forgive her now? No. I don't think so. Harper stripped this place bare. How are we supposed to rebuild? Are we supposed to deal with this mess all by ourselves? Do we just rebuild and forget about what happened? Uh, fine? Yeah. Guess we'll figure it out ourselves. Well, I think that's our cue to set out for home. Again. I may not have been from here originally, but... You stay someplace long enough, it'll start to feel like home. Feel bad that they'll always just remember me as some mad scientist that created a monster. Just one more thing left to do. Don't come back, Harper! We don't want you here. I 
know, Jesse, for all the grief we gave each other getting to this world, I'm really glad we came. Yeah, Petra. Me too. we started. Is it weird that I'm happy to see this place again? Yeah, it's pretty weird. This place makes my skin feel all prickly. Well, I'm just excited that we're going home. That's what I'm trying to focus on. Now, when we built this place, we also made something that sort of acts like a compass slash map slash navigator. We called it the Atlas. It helps chart routes between the worlds. And you have this Atlas, right? Uh, no. No, I don't. But, but I know who does. Ah. Uh. Huh. Guess I should have seen that coming. You're not keeping secrets from us again, are you, Harper? No, 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 I, I promise. I just didn't think to mention it before. Don't you worry. We'll just go right in, ask for the Atlas, and then you'll be home. No muss, no fuss, easy. Funny. Whenever someone says that, my instincts start screaming, danger. In order to find the Atlas, we need to track down the rest of the old builders. Still don't like that name. How do we find them? Which portal do we go through? Oh, you don't have to go through another portal. What you're looking for has been right here the whole time. And there you go. All it's waiting for is the key. That's the heart. you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. Adventure? 